Hello guys, once again welcome back to Dark World Studio. In this video we are talking about how to enable audio ports in Mac OS 26 that is Tahoe. First, we need this file for activating audio port. These files are free. You can download it from my website. Now, visit my website. Link is given in the description. Here you can see an option Mac OS. Inside that you can see Vanilla. Click that. Here we can see the video. Under that you can download the file by clicking here. It will start downloading. After that click on debug. Now click on the first link that is start with kernel and an extension with DMG. Click that. After completing downloading go to download folder. Here you can see these two files. Now Extract the file audio kex by right clicking, open with Active Utility. Now it will extract and you get that four files inside the folder. First, open Open Core Configurator. Right click and open. After that, after that go to menu bar. Here you can see the icon. Click that and mount your EFI. In my case, my EFI on this drive, mount, then type your system password. After that, click on open partition. Here we get a EFI, enter that, enter OC. Here you can see a folder, text, open that. And confirm that there is an Apple ALC text. Otherwise, you can copy the Apple ALC to this drive. Okay. Now, go back. Here you can see a file config.plist. Right click and open with open core configurator. In that you can see an option nvram. Inside nvram choose the third option. Here you can see boot argument. Here you should add your ALC ID. If you don't know how to add ALC ID then go to description. I added a video for that. If you are confused or not able to install then message me in whatsapp or you can message me in instagram both links are given in the description after that change csr active config to 030840 okay now go to file and save now close this file now we need to install kernel debugging double click after that run this file by double clicking continue Continue, continue, then agree, continue, enter your system password. After completing the installation, run this file, my kex installer, double click and open. Now click on install kex. Click OK. Here, type your password. After that, navigate to this folder. That is your download folder. Here you can see. Here you can see Apple HDX. Now select Apple HDX, then choose. The installation will be completed soon. After installation, reboot your system. Then after rebooting, you can see your audio ports are enabled. If you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe. 